everybody. So I'm hanging out today with Rick Champagne from HP, and man, you got a big, big facility here. What is going on? Well, so on Monday, we announced our commercial VR strategy, and so this booth is really a representation of that. So I'm going to give you a quick tour, nice, and I'm going to show you all the cool things we're doing here. Awesome. Let's check it out. All right. So um, starting on this side, uh, we're really excited about this because this is an entire live broadcast studio. Excellent. And so the studio over on the, the right there in the center, we do interviews all day every day with people like, uh, we had Chris Viano from Autodesk nice, in there earlier nice. today, cool. for example. And so all of this is being broadcast live. Um, and then of course there's an edit and it gets posted later on as well. And I well. know this machine. You know that machine, yes. Z840. That's right. That's the box that makes Journey to VR happen every week, right there. Right buddy. on, right on, yeah. Love that so that's computer. powering this Love studio. It. Very, very cool. All right, and so then moving over here, we have some other VR experiences. And again, we, we really wanted to show the breadth of possibility with commercial VR. Okay. So starting over here, we have um, a healthcare uh, demo, which this is a company by the name of First Hand, and what they're doing is they're using VR to help with pain management. Okay. And so you see that they have this cart here um, that they can. It's a mobile, mobile. It's a mobile moving around the hospital. VR cart, and they can move it around the hospital to bedsides and things like that. Very so, cool. It looks uh, like she's got a hand, hand uh, leap. That's right. She's throw got throw a leap motion to do the hand tracking. Over here, we have an example of location-based entertainment. Yeah. And so um, here we're partnered with VRC, or the okay. virtual reality company, sure. and we're showing Raising a Ruckus. Uh, this, is, this was animated, of course, in Maya, and uh, it's all built on the Unreal Engine, and so we're showing it with... Uh, the chairs. That's right. Got to have the chair. Got to have the chair. So one for you, one for me, we get to take them home? I would love to do that. Yeah, that would be cool, right? That. So the next thing I want to show you is something that we just announced at the show. It's what? the HP ZVR Backpack. And so this is a super high performance computer that was purpose built to do untethered VR. And so all of the ports are, are uh, set up so that you can have an HTC Vive, a business edition or an HTC Vive. You can roam around in room scale VR completely untethered. It has hot swappable batteries so that you can keep going for as long as you like. It has Miracast built in so that you can connect an external display to it. Okay. So that, so how you know. Does it, how does it Get the signal to the display from the. It's wireless display, so there's nice. there's a dongle over here. So you can unplug these batteries here, and then you can just take the pack off. Wait, so that's. So now. So what's what's the GPU that's in this? This is an, an Nvidia Quadro P5200, just announced here at the show. This is the only uh, mobile works or it's a, a workstation really uh, that has this GPU in it today. That's cool. That is exciting. That's, Does it look familiar? That's Arnold 5. That's Kicking right. it. <laughs> this is Rodrigo. What's going on, man? So we are yeah. here. Yeah, just rendering this beautiful scene in a 4K monitor. That's right. Looks, that guy's freaking me out. <laughs> <laughs> He's freaking me out. So we are showing Arnold, of course, and we're showing the 3DS Max uh, interactive uh, bundle. So Stingray with 3DS Max really showing how you can do VR content creation. And then, um, down at the other end, what we're showing is we've, um, uh, we have John Wick, okay. so the VR experience. I don't know if you've seen that yet. No, I haven't. But you get to be John Wick. Okay. Um, and so the other thing that we're showing with it, though, is uh, we've partnered with Starbreeze, showing their Star VR HMD. Oh, cool. And so this is an HMD. It has a 210 degree field of view. Wait, can I try that? That's, That's what I'm talking about. Next level stuff. Next level stuff. Here at Two HP. and a half K per eye too. So oh. it's a high resolution HMD. And what, what's the video car driving it? And they're using the new oh. ZVR backpack. So it's the Quadro P5200 driving this one here. So backpack goes on. Yeah. I'm pretty excited yeah. about this. <laughs> can, can you actually hold the gun? Because sure. we're going to put the headset All right. on here. All right. All right. Got it. Your eyes. Okay. So you should see on your left over here. Oh, that's that's different than my Vive. Okay, so there's a bit of a clarity adjustment. So grab the front sides of the headset. Okay. Slide it up or down. Yeah. Okay, I'm good. Towards the clearest. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. So let me go ahead and tighten it. Make sure it's nice and snug. Wow. So what, what's what's the vertical? If it's 210 this way, what's the vertical? Dude, 
<laughs> Pretty awesome, isn't it? Okay. I like I like sound. Sounds good. Okay. Can I, can I have my gun back? Yes. I really want my gun. Have fun. Oh my. <laughs> Pretty cool. You got to try it. Have you done it? I haven't done it yet. It's, I, I will. It, it's. It's awesome. Is yes. that what's over here? Or is that the same? No, th so this is something that's different. So again, just trying to show the different applications for VR and commercial uh, applications. This system is multiplayer. Okay. And so you can see that few, uh, few they can all there. see each other in, in, inside the volume. They can all be um, together. They can be on separate floors, but it would all look to us as if they're Standing near each other, right? But they could actually be in completely places um, in, in, in the building, different different locations. Exactly. So, um, but yeah, this is uh, an amazing system because the other thing is you see that they they have all of the trackers on their uh, legs Exterior. and on their yeah, arms. They're... But the other thing that they're wearing is that they have some little pads that have electrical current. And so what happens is when you get shot inside the system, you get a little uh, little shock. Oh. Well, that makes it fun, doesn't it? Yeah. And so, but really, that's to help the person understand that you know you really you know heighten your your focus because something real is happening here. Nice, really, so really it's, cool. it's just a, a real good cue for that. Thanks again for all your help. You guys have been a big supporter of ours, and uh, we really appreciate it. And the stuff you have here is it's killer. It's so so cool. Yeah, thank you. Cheers, man. Cheers, right on, Joe. That headset was awesome.